Howdy y'all, it's your host Rowan. Welcome back to Love of Games. We're continuing our adventures in the Dark Pictures anthology, The Devil in Me. And we're trying to escape this freaking maze. Which, they shouldn't have been in the maze to begin with. Jamie's death was for nothing. But uh, please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We're going to see what we can do in this episode. Right now. We came in from there. There's a path over there. Path, path. And the path. This is freaking me out. Freaking music gets you. So oh, that's creepy. I feel like we should have went the other way. Yeah. We're backtrack. Wait. Don't tell me we're lost now. We're gonna backtrack. Yeah, we would have missed out on a coin worth five. Did y'all should pick up like something to use as a weapon? There's a letter over there shining on the ground. Listen, there's something I noticed about Jumet. What? Okay, listen, when I was a kid, I didn't speak much. No kidding. No, I mean, like, at all. They called it selectively mute. Like, I could talk, but I chose not to. And what's that got to do with Dumet? We've never heard his voice. So... One of the things they said about it, the psychologists, was that I was hiding. That I was scared that if I spoke, I would give away my identity. That's the same as Dumet. Same reason he wears a mask. No, it's more than that. There's a conflict in his identity. He doesn't even know who he is. It's like he's caught between being two people. Or he's trying to separate the killer from the regular guy he has arrested at the time. Maybe. I know he's your son, but I married you for you, not for your son. Besides, it's your ex-wife's ex responsibility to stop him from doing stupid things, not mine. Oh, I don't know. I think maybe I'm just depressed already because of this trip. Not what I had in mind when you said you were taking me to a secret island. I don't care if he's Harrison Lee, the famous horror fiction writer. You only work for him, you don't have to go on vacation with him, too. Can you spend some time with the two of us, Cecil? Dear Kurt, I thought it'd be easier to write this down because I got upset when I tried to talk to you about it. I'm in distress. You know I don't get along with Thomas. I don't get why we have to take him with us or take him everywhere with us. But you're on a mission, he's a fucking nightmare, and it's getting down, having him around all the time. Okay. Is 
the Jamie's dead dead. There's no doubts about that. FBI badge. Bloodstained Chicago Police badge. Brandon Day. So that may be the guy. That could be who this is. It could be Brandon Day. This, this is where we were. Were. This, I was confused when we looked at the map because I thought it was showing us at the, at this, but no. Why can't I go up? Can I not go up? I have no idea if I went the right way or not. I have a feeling that should be off though. We got to find an electrical box somewhere. Electrical box is not over here, is it? It's crazy we haven't ran into Demet yet. When he's in this maze with us. Coming, Kate? Are you gonna? 
pay a fare. Newspaper, holy true shine killer Good killed. Good morning, Chicago. We begin today with some breaking news. Chicago police today confirmed the body of a man found in a fire at an abandoned warehouse in the Fulton River District to be that of missing FBI agent Hector Monday. Monday has been identified as the shoeshine killer whose recent killing spree struck fear into the hearts of locals in and around Chicago. A spokesperson for Chicago PD confirmed Monday murdered four victims, including yesterday evening police officer Patrick Stanley, a dedicated veteran of 22 years. The fire was brought under control shortly before 5 a.m. this morning. The body recovered at the scene was burnt beyond recognition, but police identified Monday from dental records. Dang. Why is Kate not joining us? Five. There's literally nothing else in here. I really thought there would have been more to this. Alright. No idea why we're split up again. Where'd she come from? She wasn't with me. You're going that way. I'm more curious what is over here. Kurt Hall. And I... You got a sundial. Locked door. You got the killer who's right freaking there. Or their statues. Fuck, ah! oh, dude. Run! 
chick got me. He just gave him a weapon. Run. Run. Barricade ain't gonna do nothing. He's got an axe. You should have been further. Rotted wood and he's got an axe. Like No. No, please. Please, please don't. Your camera was busted, so how do you have a camera now? We didn't go back and pick it up. Can I jump down there? I just turned on. I can't even see what that says. I think it says notice. I have no idea what I'm even looking at. Can I jump down into the pool? And over here. You have no head. hand. Jesus. The changing room. Why? Does it do that?
I wasn't meaning to open it yet. Oh God. What happened here? Again, Dumat can't be, or Dumont can't be in all these places at once. Harrison and Lewis Lee. Something over there. What the hell? What? I mean, it's bloody, but half the stuff in this is. That's going to take me forward. I want to go that way just yet because I must. That was a door opening, 100%. Fuck you, man. more bits why is that now aimed here it was not aimed here when I walked through a second ago Oh, there's... I would have missed that. Well... That would suck. We're missing, what, two? Two? Oh, shit. 
Charlie, the hotel ground. So everyone's outside. Honestly, find it better to be out of the murder castle than in. I can't see what we're. Oh, a coin. Oh, I would have missed that. I don't know if I need to go up or go this way. That that's closed off. I could use that. Why can we see your teeth? I don't want to climb, I want to push, I think. Or can I pull? Push. Um, where am I pushing this to, though? There's barbed wire everywhere but this side. You could totally climb that. I guess over there to where the barbed wire is cut though. It looks like we're putting him into the maze. Dude, talk about a creepy place. We got two ways we could go. We go left or we go right. Uh, 
Um, well, I guess we have one way to go, because there's no way you're going that way. That looked like a freaking wolf. That item. Worth five. We are being surrounded. We are not alone. No entry. Oh, shit. Oh, that was a dog. Well, everyone knows where you're at now, Charlie. So Charlie, I think, has the big, biggest bullseye on him currently now. There are so many different ways to go. How is there absolutely nothing over here? Yes, so we got the high ground. Everyone knows where we are. Jumping down an elevator shaft. Maybe I hit the button first. What's it doing? Oh, don't get yourself killed, Charlie. Don't get yourself killed. You're like my third favorite. Or fourth. I don't know. Charlie? You're alive. We've broken ribs. 
Charlie, I, I thought you were dead. I nearly was. I'm sorry for that. I, I thought... How the hell did you make it out here? Yeah, good to see you too, mate. I nearly got fried, you know. I know. We saw it. You saw it? What the hell does that mean? How exactly did you get out of that? Where are the others? Mark was suspicious of Charlie wanted to know how he survived the furnace. Mark, are they, are they safe? We were all separated trying to get out. Dumet has the entire place rigged with traps. We followed right into his game. We have to get out of here. Get back to the ferry. Dumet disabled it. We all agreed we'd head for the lighthouse if we can't signal for help. I don't suppose there's any good news. Actually... <sighs> I never thought I'd say this again. Sweet. Can I not walk further? Okay, I guess not. Oh, did you shimmy? You shimmied. Jesus. I just like saying shimmy. You're, I mean, you are a distance from land, but that is swimmable if you are a swimmer. Or you can makeshift yourself a little raft. Oh, we could go up. the busted window there. Watch this be locked. I need to find a way out. I'll just put it forward right now. If you're at a door with a glass window and you're being hunted by a killer, Break the freaking glass window. Oh, you're gonna make the killer have to pay to replace a window pane when he hasn't replaced any of the others? Or some of them have the glass window completely busted already. You could have just killed that dude. You gonna cross? I can't see shit in here. What's our next premonition? Astronauts? Oh, that must be the next game. Medical history. Patient's name, Hector Monday Whalen. Physician, Charlie Brown. 
I saw Hector, seven-year-old male, in my office today. He is accompanied by his mother who informed me that Hector is complaining of feeling sick and very tired. Upon examining Hector, he appears to be mildly undernutritioned. He is underweight and very pale skin. His mother also prescribed two milligrams of diazepam tablets to be taken but three times daily when required. I saw Hector, seven-year-old male, in my office today. The follow-up on recent hospital admission for acute bronchitis, Hector had collapsed during school lessons. Hector is recovering well from the virus in two weeks since the hospital admission. It was likely caused by mixing with other children in school while his immune system was weakened by malnutrition. When examining Hector's chest, I discovered bruising on his underarm shoulders caused by rough play at school. Hector is advised to avoid such activity. Mother advised to refrain from smoking around Hector, especially while he's recovering. I will arrange follow-up appointment in one week. This, uh, I saw Hector, seven-year-old male, in my office day. At my request, Hector was almost fully recovered from bronchitis. Bruising has worsened, caused by significant force. More likely, an adult with school friends arranged to follow up in one week. I saw Hector, seven-year-old male, in my office day. At my request, he was accompanied by his grandmother, George. By his great, oh, grandfather George. Hector's original bruising had subsided. Grandfather advised that I. Examined Hector's legs. Ankles were swollen with cuts as if he had been restrained. Grandfather suspect Hector's mother isn't coping and arranged fall up with Hector's mother. That all is up here. You know, key. Can I jump down? I jump down? No. Dude, cross. There we go. That was the first thing I've seen for anything potentially for a new game. But I'm glad to see that they are, they do have plans. Now that's a hole. Whoa. What is that smell? Rid of my eyes. Ugh. Mold. Rotting flesh by the looks of it. Yeah, I did too. Scared the shit out. You scared him off by panicking most likely. That's when he was still there. Can I not get stuck on random things? How's your head? Two victims discovered with their heads switched. Alright, another gruesome scene was discovered in an abandoned warehouse in the outskirts of Dalton, Georgia. The two victims are believed to be the latest of the homicidal murdering spree of the imaginary killer. Along with the two victims, FBI agent Monday reportedly counted multiple repurposed body parts of the crime scene that appear to be past victims. Monday described the uh, macabre animatronics covered as deranged creations that are insult... To the victim's humanity. DNA is yet to confirm if they are in fact the missing body parts of the previous victims. Uh, uh, 
Maybe turn out your lights. Again, maybe turn out your lights. Yeah, he hundred percent sees you. Dumbass. You're in almost pitch black room with a light. Oh, Charlie. Ugh. No, not wanting to see that again. No. This way. Don't get out this way. Oh my God. What? What is he doing? He's preserving his kills. Why? Because they're valuable to him. The trophies. Dude, the smell in here. Dude, my show seems to know a lot. Do you think maybe we're dealing with more than one person? What do you mean? Tending this place, the weird robots, the traps. Could it be just one man? It's one man. One very driven, very disturbed man. I'm questioning whether it's one person too because it the timing does not work out Fixation, section, removal of body fat, impregnation, positioning, hearing. Dr. Lee Harrison. Subject, dead by asphyxiation. Subject, wash, freezing, not required as formal high solution is prepared. Moving to curing has to preserve. Commence preservation. 
Early decomposition has not been shown with various deterioration visible specimen by animatronic integration. Formaldehyde fixation solution introduced to subject's cardiovascular system. Fixation solution process complete. Subject added to acetone bath. Re-examination 24 hours. No issues found with the subject in acetone. No signs of rigidity as of yet. Re-examined 48 hours. Good progress. Signs of rigidity in extremities. Previous subject, Mr. Lewis. Harrison required disposal in acid bath, rigor mortis, rich skin, causing severe blistering, resultant in unviable specimen. Possibility due to subject smaller structure exhibiting decomposition, 185 pounds versus 142. Delay in fixation commencement were for malahide es level estimate too low. Continue positive progress, extremities fully hardened, extending into stiffness of limbs, re examining in one week. Limbs 50% hardened, acetone drained and replaced, re-examined in 24 hours. No issues with new acetone replacement, re-examined in one week. So you're destined to be an animatronic. He's harvesting the organs too. He that could be how he's paying for everything. Oh crap. The feeling that's gonna trigger something. Obvious door. You're joking. Looks precarious. Is he hiding his face as he's detected Monday and he got stuck in a fire? But Monday was supposedly died. What am I? There is a path. Need to find a way up. We could go through here. Help me up. Um, oh, I didn't see this. I can either go up over here, look in, probably where we're supposed to go.
Oh, there's multiple paths. Well, dang. Hopefully you find something good in there. Oh, a coin. Worth. No, oh, that looks like 10. Dang, dude. There's eight just right around here. Nine, ten, eleven. Dude, that's gonna make so much noise coming down. Like that is gonna notify everybody. All right. You gotta, you gotta go. Yeah, there's no denying the uh, Triple H that we came this way with the sound of that crashing through. That said, whoever's lightest first. Come on. You got this. Hey, there's the lighthouse. Eight forest path. gonna call it an episode thanks for tuning in comment subscribe share the video tell me what you think in the comments section down below see you guys in the next episode plus and uh see who we can hopefully keep alive throughout the rest okay